I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you've built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stuff. Here's your stuff! Gotta give that wheelman props. Manhattan rush hour is no joke. I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you've built for your friends around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stops by again... Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not to leave anything there. But I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. That buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep, please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. We got him. Available unit. Report of an assault in progress. Please mobilize toward blood iron. Over. You want to fight? It's your lucky day. the irony in me saying this, but I hope you've learned not to hit people. Nailed it. Drug deals and criminals. They go together like cookies and milk. Aww, you guys are like little kingpins in training. So cute! Knocking the ever-loving stuffing out of dealers is my anti-drug. A text... Hi, Herman. Seriously? For Herman, what do you care? Actually, I don't. Just trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking. But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. Herman. 
What? The only answer to Shocker now? Mr. Shocker? Gotcha. Now let's talk. I said I'm done talking! Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Not enough. Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for... ...dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here. And I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah. Whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Peter! I do for you. I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. 
Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. Investigating. Don't worry. I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I, mean, I didn't forget, forget, I just... Uh, I'll be there soon. His tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? <clears throat> Attention unit. Civilians are trapped following a car crash. Officers needed near Civic Center. We got this, Spider-Man. Thanks anyway. safe. I should clear out so the professionals can get in. Ooh, 
that's a keeper. Love a happy ending. All units 1010 narcotic sale reported in progress. Local officers, please converge on Civic Center. My suit's onboard AI can tell me the most likely area where the victim is. Hey, we don't need you here right now, right? How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker. 
How the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <sighs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work. In a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. I wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Harry left me a message about these before he left for Europe. I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. Would you look at that? Half the crime tower's back up already. When spider cops on the job, come hell or high water, the job gets... Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it, but the chief was warming up to spider cop. His casual disregard for by-the-book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around. Someday. Officers respond. We've got a 10 10 narc. Spider Man. Shocker has escaped. And now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was. But one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did he get out of the guard? I wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any new sense. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank.
Need backup for a vehicle pursuit in progress. Officers, please converge on Longacre. Peter, I've been looking into the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. The vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. Take him out! Here's your stuff! They call organized crime. That concludes our Spider Man car tour of New York. Someone's getting robbed. Oh, huh, you started without me. Spider-Man, get him! No! Sorry about that. Where was I? Oh, yeah. The vacuum I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. What were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Sorry. If Harry were here, he'd talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Thank hey, you. Narcotics still in progress. Need a local unit on scene. Officers near Devil Shelf, please report to the scene. The Wouldn't be New York without a hey guys! You got prescriptions for this stuff! Watch <laughs> 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 did keep these wannabe pushers in check. I love photography.
Rest up, peace. Herman, long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa! Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid, you just stupid. You talk too much! Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal... Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because if I don't, they'll kill me! Stand still! If you ask nicely, maybe. Coming your way! If you come clean, I can help you! You really want to help me? Sorry, not gonna happen. You know, people don't use banks anymore. You're lucky you found actual cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trading. It's all the rage. No! Wait, 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 wait! No, no! Oh, come on, Herman! Just tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead! They made that very clear! Catch! Let's kick it up a notch! I should have recorded this. You're freaking me out, Herman. It's not like you to be afraid of people. Not even sure these guys are people. Could be anything under those masks. Wait, did you say masks? These mask guys. What do they want the money for? Don't know. <laughs> Give up now and we can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I see! What the? God! You son of a... Okay, last chance to give up! This time I really mean it! We're going! Okay, I was kidding before. Now is your last, last chance. Seriously. Sorry, Herman. Ah! You brought this on yourself. Literally. He was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind Bart.
Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. The fight with Shocker took a while. Time to catch up on what I've been missing out in the city. The message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope this plan works. Come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. Hey, Yuri, any idea what Fisk uses that ship guard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working the Fisk case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. Not loving that demons are targeting me now, thing. Available units, report of an assault in progress. Attention units, drug deal reported. Need an officer to check it out. Need immediate response at Union Square. All units, a break in was just reported. Location is north of Houston. Over. Analyzes hazardous chemicals. 
and basically trying to figure out how to counteract them if they ever got out into the world, which <clears throat> hopefully they never will. Oh no, someone broke in and stole a volatile rocket propellant. And they must have cracked the container because it's leaking. From the timestamp on the security cameras, it just happened. I need to get it back. My spider bots are still just prototypes, but this is a good time to test one. Its sensors can follow the chemical trail. Better than me swinging up on the thief. If he freaks out and drops the hydrazine, he'll blow up half. Gotta find a quiet place to deploy the spider bot, where I can hang out and guide it. Not only is Mini-Me cleaning up the spills, it's leading me right to the thief. The thief's hiding in crowds. I'll disperse him with a subsonic blast. Won't hurt anyone, but it's super annoying. Lucky this stuff's only dangerous over a long exposure. Or if it combusts. Maybe... Maybe not. End of the trail. He's running. We gotta wrap him up with a web burst. He's webbing me! Got him. Now to get the fuel back. Can I get an Got it. Now I just need to return the fuel to the station. This little spider bot's useful. If I can ever find a way to make him cost effective, they'd be a big help. Chemicals back where it belongs, I beefed up the station's security, and sent Yuri the camera footage to convict the thief. Not a bad day's work. This is one station that was already earning its keep. It should be safe from being shut down, especially now that the chemicals are locked away. running jobs for the demons. These guys are serious. They just want to replace Fisk? That'd be bad enough. Hope it's not something worse. Okay, so this station collects overflow data from all the others. God forbid we waste Oscorp's server space. Anyway, do me a favor and make sure it's running smoothly, or everything these stations do is for nothing. This isn't nearly enough server space. It's close to overloading. That'll trigger a purge, and everything Harry has will be lost. I can't let that happen. Wait, ESU has a backup server near here they never use. That can handle the excess data, but I'll need to realign the transmission dishes to make a link from here to there, fast. The active receiver's easy. Okay, now to find another link in the array. Got it. Just have to keep doing that. What's taking up all that space on Harry's servers? Looked like DNA sequencing, but 
That seems beyond the scope of the research stations. Focus, Pete. It won't matter what's on the server if it all gets erased. Getting close. Should be in view of the ESU server now. Got it. Now I can initiate the data transfer if I hurry. Good. Looks good. Let's see. This is for all the marbles. It's working! Everything stored successfully. Should be fine until I have Norman assign Harry some more server space. And he'll be glad to when he sees what the stations have been doing. Love that shot. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup, but that don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check. Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes on. What caches are the demons after? Need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. Might need to deal with them first. I heard that. A lot of junk scattered around here. A well-placed web shop. A great distraction. Geno. I heard that. Sleep it off. You know this old bootlegger tunnel isn't going to seal it. Who's there? Now what? 
literally didn't see that coming. Open fire! He webbed me! You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. Smart, but I don't have anything that packs enough current. Try this. Stun gun, genius. Capacitors in this are just what I need for an upgrade I've been thinking of. Gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. Started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. Sound hollow to you? I got a hidden panel, like the one on the door. The conduits lead out the back. Look for another junction box. Let's see if my mask lenses can pick up the conduits. Did that work? Nah. Must not be the right box. Keep looking. Way I could have unlocked this myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. Hmm. I got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room that could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. found a scrape. Oh, I guess normal doors don't count, huh? Good guess.
Pay dirt. Scrape, no door. None I can see anyway. Hey, be right there. Maybe not. Elevator's busted. Sit tight. I'll pull you up. Yeah. Second floor, rusted machine parts, big hunk and rats. <laughs> Careful, the bridge is out. I got this one. <sighs> nice, stuck the landing and everything. We're not all donut eaters. <laughs> Fair enough. Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. <laughs> Found one. Nailed it. Hell yeah, you did. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. But look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. Found it. Clear. You were right, Jeff. Trapdoor. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. The place is unstable. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. Sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Come on, let's go! Damn, demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an armory. Or was. Got empty crates here. And it looks like they took the ones they didn't clean out. There's a fenced off room here they didn't bother with. Too much effort to break in when you can just peel back the wire mesh over this gun rack. Smash and grab. They were moving fast. There. They blew the locks to get in. Shh. Demons. Stay here. Hell no. It'll take both of us to stop them. And some of these. They're moving. Let's go. Get them! Find cover! Welcome to the air show. That's what I'm talking about. Just trying to do my part. Look out! Firing! Stay clear! Now you're just showing off!
with that. Samba, one, go! You okay? Go! I'll catch up! If I lose two trucks full of gunmen in one day, it's time to hang up the web. Safe, Jeff. Don't do anything crazy. This kid's stuff bystanders will get shot. I gotta get in close. Here's your stuff. Hey guys, room for one more? to run on time. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Hop in. She's good. Man, I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, 
Uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage, Bowery and Grand. It's not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck. I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. Confucius Plaza. I could use some of his wisdom right about now. Of course it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. Hey, it's a long shot. But sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east side. Uh, Leo's. Leo's, yeah. That might be it. Wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. No worries. Hope you find your stuff. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. No sign of my stuff. <laughs> what an interesting smell. You don't mind, right? Eddie, you're my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. The Williamsburg Bridge. A convenient route to... Uh-oh. Looks like trouble. Thanks, Spider-Man. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. I think that's it. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. Please be here, please be here. Yes! Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work.
Got it. Look, it's that guy who can see Spider-Man. Uh-oh. Ice him! Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ. All right, how am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ, it's Peter. Any chance I could stay over to... Oh, that's too MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and... Ah, oh, that's lame! Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Okay, that just sounds pathetic! Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I... Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh. Looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Huh. Someone left me a voicemail. Number's blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me. Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. Hello, Spider. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. Black Cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. Need to look harder. There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were gonna meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter, I'm sorry. I also kinda got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Well, of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. <sighs> Can't believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. What are you doing here so late? So, I got the job. Hope May's couch is comfortable. Miss you. Man, 
was I ever a dork? I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after- Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward. All units, mass terrorists have opened fire. Nearest units converge on Lower Chinatown. This station's simple, but really important. It measures toxins in the air, way more sensitive than anything the city has. Bad air hits children and the elderly first. This was a big one for my mom. If his data is accurate, there's way too much sulfur dioxide in the air. I have a spidey hunch this is caused by inefficient engine exhaust. If I get some fresh samples, I can identify the make and model and report them. Got that one. <laughs> this can't be good for me. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Just need a few more samples. Oh, oh that one smells. Just a couple more. <coughs> That's it. <Phew. laughs> okay. Looks like we have three guilty parties. I'll need to get pictures of them for proof. Taking pictures. One down. That's a keeper. And the hat trick. All set. That'll get a recall ordered, courtesy of your Earth-friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Hey, 
Jeff. Congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the Fisk construction site in Midtown. Life would kill me if I ditched a ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Just never mind. <laughs> Howard, long time no see. How's Pidgey doing? He's a little down today. Misses his cousins. Been a bit of a whirlwind for both of us. Owners of my building, rezoned for commercial. We had to move into feast to get our bearings. I'm so sorry. New York landlords can really be heartless. When they kicked me out of my place, they set all my birds loose. Pidgey's the only one who found me. I've been looking everywhere for the rest of them, but with my bad leg and all... You know what? I get around. How about I keep an eye out for him? You do that? Oh, thank you. If you have any luck, please give me a call. <laughs> 